Thanks, Mark. Now, connecting with a medical caregiver can be difficult for people, especially veterans. Telemedicine is the new wave, and a clinic recently opened on Moncrief Road as an outpatient facility with a focus on that telemedicine. That I'm bringing the medicine to you as opposed to you coming to me. So that means that not only can patients, veterans, see us here locally, but we're throughout Florida. Dr. Ivory Turner expounds on the new way for patients to connect with medical professionals. Well, telemedicine simply means virtual clinical exam. So that means instead of you coming to see me inside of a clinic or a hospital, well now, virtually, I can come to you. Using your laptop, tablet, or cell phone, you can be anywhere in Florida to speak with a doctor or nurse. There are many benefits to using this process. The first and foremost thing is access, right? So with the advent of the Affordable Health Care Act, well now we have more patients than we do providers. So there's always going to be a struggle with getting everybody seen. So the clinicians, myself included, we've all had to get more creative in finding ways to improve healthcare access for, for patients. Also, telemedicine is very efficient. It's easy, whereas you get in your car and you're fighting the traffic or you're spending hours at the ER um, to be seen, again, from the comfort of your own home, but now you can virtually see a provider. And then last but not least, it's very cost effective. So it's much, much less expensive to see me virtually than it is in person. Convenience is another benefit. You don't have to schedule appointments that will eat up hours of your day or cause you to miss time from work or school, especially when you consider what can be diagnosed online. So we see patients um, who have a wide variety of illnesses, intermediate care, so things like cough and cold, or allergies, skin conditions, things that I can easily diagnose um, by way of someone telling me their symptoms. Mental health is a really, really, really good opportunity to take care of patients because, again, you're talking to the individual, there's not much of a physical exam um, necessary, but you have an immediate um, way, if you will, to talk to the patient, find out what's going on, and then you can you know, prescribe medication if that's needed. The EMD Now Walk-In Clinic in Northwest Jacksonville offers opportunities for veterans and the surrounding community. Dr. Turner explains why she and her husband launched their program. EMD Now was created by um, two people, myself and my husband, um, for the sole purpose of helping to improve healthcare access for veterans. Um, I myself, I'm a veteran, I'm a Navy veteran, my husband um, has also worked at the VA, and we both, you know, know that they work tirelessly there at the VA um, to help uh, the veterans, but they're limited with respect to being able to see everyone in a timely uh, fashion. So we just want to do our part. But what's really cool about being here locally is that we serve a need for not only the veterans, but also the people in this immediate community. And so before, patients would have to wait for the big pharmacies with respect to the technology of something like this. But now, it's right here in, in this neighborhood. And so patients can come and see me, and then when we're done with our evaluation, can simply walk right across the way here and see Dr. Chester at Newtown Pharmacy and get their medications filled. I'm Rance Adams for River City Live. The EMD Now Clinic is located at 3146 Moncrief Road. It's open Monday through Friday from 8 to 5 and 9 to 1 on Saturdays. If you want to go the telemedicine route, 8 to 10 p.m. Monday through Friday, 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. on Saturdays. Uh, they accept patients with or without insurance. Consults are $59 or $39 for veterans. And they're offering free health service, health care services to those impacted by the government shutdown. So you can walk into the clinic or you can look to connect online at myemdnow.com. So stick around. We've got more River City.